Hi, and welcome to Anuvica's Take 10. I'm Edward Adlers, Director of Marketing for Anuvica, and joining me today is Alex Perkins, Director of Technical Services. With the increasing number of non-Windows devices available in the market today, IT departments are evaluating how to make them part of their IT strategy. The biggest problem, however, is that most business applications are built to run on Microsoft Windows. So how can you overcome that barrier to adoption? Well, today we're going to show you how you can use thin clients like Raspberry Pi as well as Chromebooks in your business without sacrificing your business critical applications. The solution to that problem rests in creating virtual workspaces using OVD Enterprise app virtualization. If you're new to Inuvica OVD Enterprise or app virtualization in general, here's how it works. We begin by taking applications and data that normally reside on your x86 laptop or workstation and move them into a cloud data center where they now run on one or more Windows or Linux application servers, along with user data stored on file servers. OVD Enterprise combines the apps, data, as well as the processing of application data together with a user interface, usually a Windows or Linux desktop or a web portal, and presents them as a complete virtual workspace environment to users anywhere on any device. Everything, however, still runs within the safety of the data center. Since no data or applications are ever transmitted to or reside on the user's end device, we immediately open up the opportunity to use any type of device. And OVD Enterprise supports traditional Mac OS, Windows, and Linux desktops, iOS and Android mobile devices, Chrome OS devices like Chromebooks, x86 and ARM-based thin clients, including Raspberry Pi, or any other device that is capable of running an HTML5 browser like Chrome, Firefox, or Safari browser. But today we'll focus specifically on two platforms that are growing in popularity in the enterprise, Raspberry Pi and Google's Chromebook. And for that, let's bring in Alex Perkins. Alex, what is it about these two platforms that make them good choices for the enterprise? Well, I think thin clients have some great advantages in, in enterprise and some of the biggest you know, benefits are the centralized management. You've got great enhanced security. They're very small compared to a traditional laptop or desktop as well. So they can be used in almost any situation. And one of the, the biggest um, benefits is the, the notably lower cost. You're going from a device that could be a thousand or thousands of dollars to potentially under a hundred dollars a piece. Um, but the, the savings themselves go beyond the cost of the hardware. If you look at the um, Stratadesk ecosystem, which works on Raspberry Pis amongst other devices, you can actually centrally manage these devices from one single point of administration, such as the No Touch Center. And this allows you to dramatically reduce the amount of time and cost, not just about setting them up, but actually supporting um, them in a sort of a longer term point of view. Now, Inuvica works closely with Stratadesk. We have the OVD Enterprise Desktop Client integrated neatly into their operating system, as you can see here on my screen. So I have set up an Inuvica client on the, on the left-hand side here. And on the right-hand side, I have a virtual machine running with the um, desktop client open. So this has all been pre-configured out of the box. You, would, you could do this remotely, so you wouldn't even have to um, have the device on site. So let me just log in now on my virtual machine. Um, so I've pre-configured it as we saw before. So I'm gonna click start now. It's bringing that desktop session online, connecting me straight into the session. So now I've logged in, we're presented with our applications like we would if we were on any other OVD um, client. So we can see I have both Windows and Linux applications side by side on my desktop. We could have Microsoft Word here, for example. I can go jump straight in, begin writing a document, can minimize this, I can switch into LibreOffice Calc for Linux. So we have the ability to have those applications side by side as though they're traditional, but it can be running from a low cost device such as a Raspberry Pi. So another great feature is we can seamlessly transfer away from the desktop client and move back to the web. So let me take you back here to the web client. So I've still got my applications running in the background here. If I go and hit connect, 
you'll see now on the right hand side of my screen the session has ended and on the left hand side of my screen the session has been restored it's been resized but the applications are still running and available with the same content in them so i've still got my word document there and i've still got my libreoffice calc file now we've seen the adoption of thin clients in some pretty interesting customer environments haven't we yes we have i mean the the beauty uh, of, a, of a pairing like this is that it, it allows you to have a really powerful delivery of applications and desktops without the need for the the traditional um, cost that comes from um, physical machines so uh, universities where they would be having like student labs and you know one thousand two thousand three thousand dollars uh, a machine whereas you can replace this with you know that sub 100 thin uh, dollar thin client that is sat on the back of a monitor it also reduces the possibility of theft things like that you've got the ability for that you know fantastic centralized management uh, that, that takes away the the time and complexity to set it up so in, in that kind of um, situation you can deliver everything you need but in a safe secure and low-cost manner so let me now show you how easy it is uh, to do this on a chromebook um, so i've still got my web session running here with my applications open i've got my chromebook here uh, as you can see so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to reconnect this session and take over uh, with the application still running so you can see now the session's been restored, the applications have switched over, but we're now running inside a Chromebook. So we get all, all the value that a Chromebook can bring as well. So not necessarily um, going down the Stratodesk OS route, but this time we're moving to another low cost device. Um, so again, you're keeping, you're keeping the cost of a, a traditional laptop that could be $1,000 a piece to you know, the $250 mark. So there's, there's a big saving on that part. And my applications are still running here. I've still got my Microsoft Word available with uh, my text and I've got my LibreOffice Calc open with my numbers in there too. And it's worth pointing out that Chromebooks also offer the same benefit of centralized management. Absolutely, and you've got all the Google Cloud management that comes with it as well. So if you're using the Google suite of applications, you get even more control. It's almost in an MDM fashion uh, for how um, organizations can control those devices. So you're sort of allowing that BYOD uh, on, the, on the low cost devices, but also giving the option to, to, to have some control over the, um, the security and deployment of those as well. If you would like to try OVD Enterprise for yourself, visit us at anubica.com slash free trial and request your free trial. You can also learn more about the user experience on OVD by visiting anubica.com slash OVD to download the data sheet or watch our video. Thanks for joining us today.